In this drawing, Donkey Kong and Pac-Man are advertised around the working boy bailing hay. Each evening after washing dishes at my uncle's Pennsylvania Dutch smorgasbord restaurant, I stopped by the local gas station and gave her half a dozen quarters. It even influenced my sketchbook as I graphed out original video game designs that I thought maybe someday I would create. But amusing oneself with video games and such always brought a certain amount of guilt when there was work to be done. In contrast, massive hours in front of screens for today's youth culture seems to be a rite of passage. Mennonites and Amish emphasize training their children in the value of hard work. It was a healthy edification, unlike the abuse of the industrial age that brought about child labor laws. Mennonites held hard work in high regard. And so to talk about how to entertain yourself, little um, emphasis was given to play other than possibly fishing or sports, maybe hunting. But boys playing video games wasn't really on the radar. Slowly, video game systems started to creep into Mennonite homes, and eventually, even I had a ColecoVision. So what is entertainment to a conservative Mennonite young person? Playing Dutch Blitz and eating popcorn. Gathering to play volleyball. Um, for New Year's, we would um, play games, do taffy pools, and so on, and then pray the new year in. Sometimes we'd start 15, 20 minutes before 12 and go a half hour after. <laughs> and we wouldn't hear when that midnight um, time struck because we prayed in the new year. I find it more comfortable and maybe even enjoyable to work than to have leisure time. I'm not completely comfortable with vacations and entertainment. On the other hand, when I was thinking about what's in the heart, I was thinking about how that gets really to the whole system. When what's in the heart goes through the, through the blood stream, it goes to my brain, it goes to my muscles, and it influences everything I do in my actions. What's in my heart really does change what I do in a very practical way. Thank you. And so for the first time in my life, I was away from the television. <laughs> I mean, I, my entire life I was in front of the television. I'm <laughs>